market match state and federally funded food assistance program could be cut from next year's state budget. Action News Now reporter Alejandro Mejia Mejia is live at North Valley Plaza, where Chico certified Wednesday Farmers Market happens every week. So Alejandro, what happens if the program is cut? Alan, earlier today, dozens of vendors and people were here at the North Valley Plaza parking lot buying and selling locally grown produce. If the program were to be cut, some people would not be able to afford shopping here anymore. It would be a blow for lo low income families and local growers alike. Cassidy Ware tells me she has been using Market Match for a little over a year now to get fresh food. She told me if the program were to go away, she would not be able to afford the local market, which can cost a little bit more than bargain grocery stores that often have fewer healthy options. If I or others who benefit from this program were to rely on other food assistance, like food bank food or um, getting stuff on sale at the store, uh, I know that I would see my health diminish because I know that being able to eat fresh food is preventative medicine and I'm able to stay healthy because of my access to fresh organic food. In a recent Market Match Impact report, over $284,000 was spent in one year by people using CalFresh and Market Match in the 1st Senate District. That's most of our area. Market Match says that for every Market Match dollar spent at local markets, an additional $3 is generated for people in the community. I spoke to one farmer who's been coming to farmer's markets just like the one here at the North Valley Plaza for years. He told me that cutting market match would affect his business. Yeah, it would have a, a big impact on the farmers because a lot of our sales weekly comes from the, the market match. Um, I, would, I, I would say almost 50% of the people that have been coming through the booth um, have been using market match and um, it really adds up. That was Paul Prather, who told me he started covering Ground Farm in 2019. Prather says every dollar in sales counts, and if market match is cut, it could mean less business for him and other farmers. Patricia Hieronymus, executive director for the Butte County Environmental Council, told me that market match is an investment in our community. It's amazing for making your dollars stretch, for getting more produce for your buck. You just get little tokens, you give it to the farmers. They're really happy that we're creating a circular economy. You're keeping the dollar in the, um, in the community and you're making our local farmers um, be able to plant their crops for next year. Jenny Dye, the, the program director for the Center for Healthy Communities, told me that if market match were to be cut, they would try to keep it available for as long as they could. Live in Chico, I'm Alejandro Mejia Mejia with Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Thank you, Alejandro. Now, in the market match report, they say just in the first Senate district alone, they estimate over 560,000 servings of fruits and vegetables were bought using CalFresh and market match. It may be cut as California looks for ways to close the gap in a projected $45 billion budget deficit.